Hello everyone. Uh, uh, thank you for coming to the uh, virtual classroom. And this is our library class. And uh, today we talk about indentation. Um, if you remember in the videos that I shared with you, we had in one part it says, one part of the video says, avoid leaning on your book to write because pens and pencils can leave indentations on book covers. If you also press too hard, they can tear through the paper and mark up the book. So I just want to show you what indentation means practically. So it's a fun, it's a, because you are, doing, you are doing some activities, okay. So please look at what actually I do and do it at home. So this is the meaning of indentation. First of all, I show you what actually I said. It means that if you have a book like this, okay, and you want to do your homework or whatever, for example, this is your notebook, you place it on the book, on the book cover, and you lean on it and start writing and doing your homework. What happens? the book will be damaged why because when you press your hand on the paper the indentations and the markings will appear on the cover and the cover and the book will be damaged what are the markings what are the indentations i will show you now um listen to me carefully for example you have a paper, for example, this is the cover of the book that you have. Okay, imagine that it is the cover of the book that you have. And you want to write, you place another paper on it, and you start writing. It can, or drawing anything. For example, I want to draw a, a star, okay, like this. I draw a star. This is my star. Okay. Then I finish my job and I remove my notebook or the paper. Look what has happened to the cover of the book. If you pull, if you um, put your hand on the paper. You feel something there, or sometimes you can see an invisible star appearing on the paper. This is called marking or indentation. Okay, do you want me to show it clear to you? You can just do this. Take a pen or take a pencil is better, a colored pencil, and like this, draw on the paper. What do you see? I'm not I'm not drawing any star, but when I color it, and a star appears on the paper. This is that indentation that you have made on the cover of the book. Do you want to try with something else? You can take a coin, any coin that you have, put it under the paper. And now start drawing and coloring, coloring the paper exactly where you have placed the coin in. Okay, the coin is under the paper and in this place. So I want to do this. Oh my gosh, what did you see? It is marked up. I take another coin, put it on the, hold it firmly, now what do you see? You see the coin exactly appears on the paper when I draw the pencil on it. 
Pontison. These are called indentation on the markings. So if you do that, the paper or the book cover will be marked up. It's fine. You can place anything under the paper or you can draw anything on another paper and place the paper on, the, on it and then remove the paper like this. I remove the paper. Like I can draw, I can draw smiley face and like this on this paper and then I remove this paper and use a color pencil or another thing and just like this. What do you see? A face, a smiley face is coming out, it's appearing gradually because the paper is marked up okay so go and do it at home and have fun